Good morning and uh, uh, thank you for this opportunity to talk to you. Uh, this visual analytic, the marginal analysis of milk production, is to understand the cost of making that additional pound of milk. Uh, there are several ways that we can go about to estimating this value. Uh, <clears throat> the, the default screen has where the user can put in what the milk price is. Uh, then one enters in the dry cow ration cost and the dry cow ration cost is an estimate of uh, what it costs to just maintain a cow in the herd and so the dry cow, um, uh, really the far off dry cow rations would be the best to, to uh, put in here in terms of what their cost is. Uh, what's the average milk production per day and then what is the average ration cost and we see that after you've entered in all of these values as you vary that uh, final ration cost uh, the dial over here then estimates what's it cost to make an additional pound of milk. Uh, so in this scenario if we're paying uh, $5.36 to feed an 80 pound cow and our maintenance cost is $2 uh, then the marginal cost is uh, $4.20. And so as you vary the uh, ration cost, you can see what happens to that, uh, uh, that marginal cost. Uh, down here is the marginal milk margin, which is simply the difference between the price of the milk minus this marginal cost. So this is the profit that is made per 100 weight of milk um, on, uh, as we make an additional 100 weight of milk. Then down here we have, based on what the uh, milk level is, uh, is entered, what we think is the intake of the cow, and one can vary what that uh, level is uh, as to what you actually see, and it estimates then a dry matter uh, cost. In other words, uh, at this uh, cost of uh, 526, if the cows are consuming about 46 pounds of dry matter, then the cost per pound of dry matter is about 11 cents. Now the other way you can look at this is to look at it from an energy perspective. Uh, and uh, this is looking at the energy value. Uh, we know that the energy density uh, in milk um, it requires about 0.31 mcals per pound of milk. Depending on what's the density in the ration, uh, 0.76, 0.78, uh, then this estimates what the marginal cost has to be. Uh, based on what values you've entered in terms of the cost of the cow. So it's yet another way uh, to look at the um, uh, cost per uh, pound of milk based on an energy uh, value. Uh, there's some other dials in here that look at um, total production costs and things like that if you uh, would like to, to look at those um, and also uh, what the lactating feed cost is per hundred weight. This is an average feed cost, not a margin. And uh, so we really emphasize that uh, one looks at the marginal cost of uh, producing feed, and that's the purpose of this tutorial. So with that, thank you very much.